What's up, Internet? Don here from DonDoes30.com, bringing you a hacking product review. I mentioned this earlier in the year that I was going to review some products that I typically use, and it is very appropriate that I go through two different products. Um, I was originally just going to review the network card that I use because I frequently get asked what, uh, what the best network card is there out there for hacking. And um, I recently ordered a second card because I'm going to be doing some, um, what do you call it, uh, evil twin attacks and things like that. And you need two wireless adapters, internet networking cards for that. So now the one that I always have recommended when people ask me is this little baby right here. It's the Alpha Network AWUS036NHA. Now you can see how sleek and beautiful it is. Um, just like I like my women, curvy and black. I'm just kidding. Um, so I ordered a, what I thought, I ordered a second card exactly like this, but what I received in the mail was this little guy. And right off the bat, you can see that it's a totally different color. Um, it kind of looks a little bluish here in the picture, but um, it's actually kind of green when you look at it in person. Anyway, um, this is the Alpha AWUS036NH. It doesn't have the A. So I kind of looked at, well, you know, it's not a bad looking card. I thought maybe at first that they said, um, you know, they just kind of changed up the color a little bit. But I dug a little deeper, and it's actually the difference between these two cards is the chipset that's in there. And the chipset that I've been using for years, let's um, pull up these two network cards. I'm going to go to Airmon. And um, one is an Atheros chipset, and the other is Unknown. The green one is Unknown. Now, again, I'm a big Atheros fan. Um, it's If you see these two cards, this is the one internal on my laptop. This is the one that's external on the USB, but the green one came through as unknown. So digging a little bit deeper, this card, or this uh, little networking interface, uses a Rawlink chipset. And at first I didn't really think it was that much of a big deal, um, but as I dug deeper and played around with it and you know tried different things, I found out that the superior card, in my opinion, is the one that I've been using all these years. Kind of confirmation bias, right? Um, but to get to that determination, I'm going to show you a couple of things here. Um, so first of all, the raw link one is this, which I don't like as much. And um, I'm going to see if I could redo some of these, these two tests here. Uh, the air replay is going to do the injection test. Uh, all your cards that you have, your networking cards, you do want injection uh, or to be able to inject packets um, and go into monitoring mode and things like that. So I'm going to first test the Rawling card. We'll see how it does. The injection is working, which is great. It's pinging. It's doing its thing. And uh, I'm going to stop it right there. Just, uh, just a short little test. Now, as you can see, the success rate of the injection, okay? Here's 90%, 96%, 76%, finally 100%, right? So, not bad. I mean, it's going to inject your packets, but uh, let's see what the other bad boy could do, huh? All right, air replay nine, and we're gonna go with WLAN three now because that's the uh, Athros chipset. Injection is working on that too, perfect. All right, and again, I'm gonna stop it just uh, after a couple. So check this out: 100% success rate, 100% success rate, 100% success rate. 100% success rate. Now, if you're comparing that to something over here, 90, 96, 76, 100, obviously the Atheros product is gonna be the better one, the better chipset. Um, I'm not messing with any of these cards. They're both equal distance away from each other, so there's no interference. They're both uh, playing off the same channel, channel 11, so we're doing the same thing for both of these cards. But when it comes to injectability, my homeboy right here wins out every time. I'm gonna put some product links down here in the um, description, so check it out. Um, again, this is the card that I'm gonna recommend in terms of packet injection. I believe that that's the winner. And um, yeah, so that's our first product review. Congratulations me. Uh, we're gonna be doing some product reviews for like the Raspberry Pi and a couple of other fun little hacking tools, but um, this is mainly the one that you're gonna need I think I'm going to keep this. I may uh, I may return it and get another one of these babies so I have uh, dual 
Atheros uh, chipsets, and that way I could uh, start my Evil Twin tutorials coming up in the future. Anyway, thanks again for watching. Talk to you guys.